My father's name is James Mateo Gedongin Jr. I'm a teacher here at Martin Luther King High School. I've worked on the project along the Chaparral and I've also helped run a Veterans Oral History Project. My father, he and his brothers all joined the Navy. He entered as a electrician and then he was a cook and he worked his way up somehow and, and was cooking for the Admiral. And I was going through all my dad's paperwork over this summer and it was just really fun to read all his reports and to hear what his experience was like because he didn't really talk about it too much with me. When he did serve overseas, he was patrolling. He did tell me a couple of stories of how they would find refugees in the water and they would pull them out and how he understood that plight. He understood what it meant to try to find a better place because that's why they came here. So I love him and I miss him. I just lost him in January of this year, 2018. And it's been really hard because my father, he was such a giving person. And one of the reasons why he wanted to join the military was he was already in the United States and he saw he wanted to give back and he wanted to be a part of America. I think that was for him such an important thing. Being an immigrant from the Philippines, being a part of the military was just a great way to be American. He served only a couple years, but it was really a part of his identity and it helped him as a person. It gave him and his family so many opportunities and I'm grateful. It paved the way for me to go to college. It gave me something more to believe in. My father always instilled in me that America, with all its faults, still has beauty in it. And I'm glad that I get to have these memories and being so close to Riverside National Cemetery. I do feel like it's here.